All right, guys, greetings. Master Tatiana here. We're going to talk today on routines and why we should switch it up, <laughs> right? So routines are amazing. They are important. It's something that we should have. We should have routines. However, routines can also be very deadly, okay? So especially for our brains, our brains is so powerful. So to be honest, we don't use it as much. We don't use all of our brains we don't we they actually say we only use a third of our brain so that is very little <laughs> so when we alternate when we switch things up right um what we do we activate the different synapses in the brain right we connect the brain in different ways and then the brain to show us another part of us yes how cool is that right your brain gets to show you another part of you whoa and then you start finding yourself, right? You start to see, oh, my brain is very flexible. You start to feel more confident. You start to feel that your brain, you start to trust your brain and know and see the, the, ops, the awesomeness of the brain, okay? So when it comes to routine, we definitely want to try to kind of switch it up every now and then. Um, I, I know so many of us out there are very powerful influencers and leaders and we always saying the right things um, and sometimes we just consume ourselves with just that that we don't realize that there's so much more to that there's so much more um, and if we could kind of like take a minute and kind of take a break and really give our brain something um, other than the same thing that we do all the time, then you will see, oh, my brain could do something else. Uh, when we start to create beautiful content and it's amazing, and then we continue to do it, to do it, to do it, to do it, we don't realize that we can also create this ease in the brain. Yes. You no, know, even geniuses get tumors, even geniuses get... Um, brain disease, get heart disease, get liver disease. We get all types of conditions um and it's not because uh you ain't using your brain right it is it, also the patterns that we have continuously use our brains in so even receiving ideas and inspiration also needs a break sometimes yes i know because i want to get a ton of ideas and i come up with so much creativity as well um, but sometimes I have to give my, I have to tell myself, be mature enough to say, I need a break. And I don't mean a break and go watch TV. I don't mean a break and go take a nice warm shower or, or, or a nice bath. That all is beautiful. But I really mean like unplugging from everything. Okay. And having like a moment of like just really connecting with myself. Like, Really, if I'm going to, sometimes what I do to, to build that momentum, I run in place. I run, 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 and I continue to run for a, a few minutes, right? And I run as fast as I can. And then as soon as I stop, I bring my hands to my heart. And then I start to feel the pulsing of my heart, right? And through that, I start to connect a little bit deeper with my lungs, and then I start to connect a little bit deeper with my liver, my stomach, and much deeper, much deeper. And of course, that takes practice to get to that, but we all have the ability to do so. So routine, as much as it is very powerful, it can also cause dis-ease in the body, okay? So many of us are very, we, we have content, we have ideas, but it's so important for us to unplug even when those things are coming. So... When it comes to me, many times I have to do this. Dodging them, you know, like, wait, wait, all right, enough for now, you know, and just trust. And trust me, I know as, as a creator, you don't want to, like, lose them. You're like, no, 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 no. But you have to realize that everything that you're trying to hold, all you're doing is, is doing this to yourself. You just making yourself into a pretzel. <laughs> and you can, after a while, you have circulation issues, you have breathing issues, um, you have headaches, you don't even explain, you can't really explain why you're exhausted. 
um, feeling so much tension in the body and it has a lot to do with routine. It has a lot to do with wanting to hold on to these ideas that are coming and they, they are some ideas, but we have to trust that these ideas are truly not officially gone. They didn't disappear. They're still around. But the moment that you take full ownership of how things are coming in, you start to notice that you feel more of a peace inside, um, more control within, right? And you, you begin to build more respect for yourself. And when I say respect, you... Even, even energy needs to respect you, respect you, your body should respect you, everything needs to respect you in relation to your true essence, okay? Your true essence needs to really be the navigator, it needs to navigate, it needs to say what it wants in the vehicle and what it doesn't need in the vehicle right now. Um, and so when we take in so much ideas, it's like our vehicle is compact, it has so many things. Um, so we need to kind of clean clean it out. We have to take it to the car wash, get it clean inside out. So routine is very powerful, but it can also cause dis-ease in the body. Um, so I just wanted to share that. Bye.